Welcome to this episode of Extravagant Generosity, where we reflect on how the practice of generosity impacts our communities, touches our hearts, and works for a more just world. My name is Andrew Warner, Generosity Outreach Officer for the National Setting of the United Church of Christ. I'm joined by John Dorhauer, General Minister and President of the United Church of Christ. John, as people of faith, our discipleship, our work as believers, proceeds from our spirituality. As we think about the spirituality of generosity, we can see it in part as the stewardship of risk. How do you see the connection between generosity and faithful risks in our Christian movement? So uh, as I hold up my scripture here, uh, one of my favorite passages is Genesis chapter 12. Um, and I see the first 11 chapters as sort of an intro to the entire scripture. It's the story of creation, the, the fall, uh, Cain and Abel, the Tower of Babel, um, the Noah and the Ark. And we come out of what I call that intro and the very first thing that happens is God meets Abram. And the very first word that God speaks in the rest of the entire scripture is the word go. And that is an invitation to risk. And it really sets the relationship between us and the creator. While we are creatures called to worship and adore and serve, we learn over and over and over again that to be in relationship with this God is to take risks of faith. It's that the word go wasn't just go, it was followed go from your country, from your family, from your homeland, leave everything behind and trust that in ways that you can't even anticipate, you will be rewarded for your faithfulness to me. Everything about our faith in relationship with this God calls us into risk. And the risks can be taken only when we trust the voice of the one calling us and sending us. And for me, stewardship and generosity are acts of faith in obedience to a God that we trust. It's an act of letting go, of risking what feels like something that gives us security, and letting go and trusting that God will provide richly on the other side of that risk. Thank you, John. Your story reminds me of all the times people of faith took, took risks. Mm. Our faith calls us to take risks just like the farmer in Jesus' parable of the sower. The farmer scattered seeds everywhere, on rocky ground, among thorns, and in fertile places. We can take faithful risks too, faiths like, like Abraham and Sarah and so many other ancestors. From these risks will grow, will grow abundantly, 30, 60, 100 fold. For all those watching this video, I invite you to consider these questions. When did you take a faithful risk? When did your community take a faithful risk? Regardless of how it turned out, what did you learn about generosity from those faithful risks? <laughs>